This is a man riding winch, and this is an inertia reel or full arrest block. They are two different devices, but there is a lot of confusion out there about what they're designed for and what you can and can't do with them. They do look quite similar. Both are similar shape, have a wire coming out of them and both have a handle, but they are quite different devices. An inertia reel is designed primarily for fall arrest, which means it will catch you if you fall. It pays in and out, then locks in a fall. It's usually only designed for lifting someone or lowering them in an emergency. For example, if someone couldn't climb out of a confined space because they were unconscious, that's when the handle is used. Inertia reels are not usually designed to be used under tension in normal access situations. For that, you need something else. So let's talk about man riding winches. A man riding winch is designed for a couple of different situations. Firstly, there might not be a ladder, step irons or similar for someone to hold onto. In this case, under normal, non-emergency conditions, a man riding winch would be used to lower someone down. The man riding winch would support their weight. But it's vital that if someone is under normal, non-emergency conditions, they have a fall arrest device such as an inertia reel fastened onto them as well as the man riding winch. This is something which most manufacturers specify and is also a requirement under the Work at Height Regulations 2005 for work positioning, which is the technique which is being used here. If someone is just fastened to a man riding winch and it fails, they will fall. Lastly, the man riding winch could be used as a rescue device to pull someone out of a confined space. So, before you use these bits of equipment, please make sure you know what it's actually designed for. We've come across lots of people using these incorrectly and for the wrong job. It's worth reading the instructions and getting some proper training too.